Oh my god, that's a glowing one. Welcome back, everybody, to Fallout on Tale of Two Wastelands with the Capital Punishment mod. This time, the Bearded OG, and in this episode, we are going to start off by uh, doing our quest turn into Three Dog here at Galaxy News Radio. And then after that, not sure what we'll do. We'll figure it out. I guess he's up this way. Yep. Hey, dude, wake up. Hey, all right! The hero of the wasteland returns. That's me, you betcha. Uh, I did what had to be done. Yeah, yeah, it was a thrill of a freaking lifetime. Um, let's be nice. Hey, you're the one that deserves all the thanks. You struck a major blow against tyranny. Mm-hmm. Now GNR can be heard clear across the capital wasteland again. That'll give Eden and those muties something to think about. Yeah, I suppose it will. Oh, I guess it gives me different options. Well, I guess this is goodbye. It's been a pleasure. Now, hang on a second there. Three dog can't let you walk away from here empty handed like this. Okay. I heard you found out about your dad on your own, and yet you went ahead and kept your promise to me. It takes some real moxie, kid. Ah, man of my word. Here, I want you to take this. I was saving it for someone special, someone who could really help with the good fight. It contains the location of an old weapons cache. You're welcome to help yourself to anything inside. Oh, okay. Hamilton's hideaway, weapons key cache. Nice. Um, didn't we already ask him all this stuff? Uh, we had, didn't ask him this. How are things since the power's back? I can't even tell you the love I'm getting from the wasteland. Ever since GNR started singing again, the guys downstairs told me that more people than ever are tuning in. Okay. It's all I ever wanted. <laughs> okay. Um, all right. Well, <coughs> I think we're done. Anytime you need a place to crash, duck in here. Be glad to provide. Thank you. Appreciate that. Um, so does that mean we can sleep? Yeah, we can sleep on his couch. All right. Nice. We still can't steal from him, though. <laughs> I mean, you'd think the least the guy would could do for us is let us steal from him, right? Okay. Uh, so, yeah, we got location to a weapons cache. 
Uh, let's see here. Miscellaneous. Archived security terminal. Password to access the strong room maintenance terminal. Uh, okay. The strong room maintenance terminal? What the hell's that? I don't, I don't even know where that came from. This we got as a, as a reward for, um... Pin limbs to the wall. <laughs> uh, we got as a reward, you know, for the Declaration of Independence. Okay. Oh, yeah. We, we could go do that thing at the Lincoln Memorial. Uh, meaning go kill all the slavers over there. Okay, so... Uh, how do we... How do we know where the weapons cache is? Did it just show up on a map? Because I don't see anything in here. I mean, we got this... This is new. I mean, I don't remember where I got that. So that could be it, but that doesn't tell us where it's at. Alright, let's look on the map. There's this Rosenhan Brewery that we haven't gone into. There's this Dukov's place. Friendship Heights. Canterbury, Temple Union, Regulator. We gotta go there and turn in fingers. Been to all of those places. We never were, uh, was able to finish Fort Detrick because uh, we couldn't get into that last room. Okay. Five axles. Dickerson Tabernacle Chapel. Girder Shade. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Clothing Shop? Yeah, I don't know where the uh, this place is, and I don't I don't have a quest for it. So I guess I'll have to um, have to do a little bit of research on that, unless it becomes apparent to us at some point where that uh, where that is. Okay, well, why don't we head back to the Lincoln Memorial and take those slavers out and do that Lincoln Memorial quest. That was a hell of a fight. Nice work. Th uh, thank you. And I think, too, after we finish that, I think we're going to go uh, get out of the city and go explore some new territory because... We've spent a lot of time in the city these last several episodes. There's more stuff to do, of course. There's the brewery. We could go do the Dukov's place. We have that, um... Uh, we have the Capitol building that we never went into. We have the Underworld library. Oh. Look at this. I didn't even know this was here. I took the long way to get here. Well, this is handy. Okay. Um, let's go to... I want to go to Underworld. Guess we can't go to Underworld, but we can go to the Capitol building, which will get us as close... Or just to the mall, actually. Yeah, let's just go to the mall. Maybe that's the one that puts us in front of Underworld. Yeah, it does. Perfect. Okay. So, uh, whoa. Uh, there was a, a lower section to here. Let's hop in and say hi to uh, Sydney. So, yeah, there's uh Where was that? Somewhere over here, there was like a lower section to this place. Oh, uh, 
Why does it want us to go through there? Okay, wait a minute. What are we doing? Find at least one Lincoln artifact in Museum of History. Oh! This is the Museum of History. Okay. Never mind. I thought we had to go to the Lincoln Memorial. We're still going to go there and kill all the slavers, but... I just want to hop in here really quick. I, got, I do have a couple things we could sell. And, uh... I'm just curious if Sydney would actually come and hang out with us as a follower. Let's sell the tulip. You came back. Do you need something? Uh, yeah. Let me see what you if have for sale. Armor fails to oh, hold on. Got to put our selling clothes back on. All of the stuff that I have in my inventory is just stuff I picked up by killing. You came back. Do you need something? Raiders and more super mutants on the way back here. So. Sure. All right. So. That's a 44 semi-automatic pistol. I, I don't know if I have one of those, so I think I'm going to hang on to that. Paratrooper pistol. That's a 45 auto. Nowhere near as good as our snake lore, which is also a 45 auto. We're going to sell all of these. Mercenary carbine. Yeah, let's sell that. Um, I'm actually using this officer's mercenary rifle. Um, I, I got it modded up and repaired back at the base. The Glock 86 plasma. I may hang on to that just to get them... I think I may actually have one of these back at the base, but I'm going to hang on to it ju just to make sure. Because I vaguely remember looting that. All right. You can take the metal armor and... I accidentally brought my weapon repair kits with me. Didn't mean to do that, but it is what it is. We can have the cigarettes. The darts. I think I'm going to keep the mini nuke. Good. Okay, so we're up to 4,393 caps. Um, I think I'll buy your 308s. I've got so many 5.56s right now. Then I think I'll leave the rest of those. Oh, she's got a... She's got a uh, Desert Eagle. That does 70 DPS and 23 damage in its current state. How does that compare to this? That's 75, 26, 70, 23. This is actually a better weapon than the Deagle is. According to those stats, they're in about the same condition too. Interesting. Okay. I'm not Another gonna buy it then. Satisfied customer. Come we might come come across one at some point later, but this is our town. Yes it is. Be careful. I'll be as careful as I can be. Are we hurt in any way? Yeah, we could actually stand to get some limb fixed up. Let's go into the chop shop. Yes, what is it now? Please be brief. I'm quite... Uh, this... this... And we're all done. Tell me about Riley's Rangers. They're a mercenary group. I've seen them pass through Underworld a few times. I'm not sure what their mission entails, but I suspect that it involves violence. Probably. The Rangers have a small headquarters not far from here. Let me program the location into your pip. Oh, nice. Okay. It would be dangerous for me to... The sudden shock... Okay. I appreciate your sincerity, but I'm afraid <coughs> it's just... Okay. So, um... I don't think I'm irradiated, or at least not significantly. 
So he just added Riley's Rangers to our map. And he said they were out east. Ranger compound. Oh, directly out east. So I doubt we could get there just by walking there. We might have to get to this Seward Metro again. Okay, let's go. I want to see where uh, Sydney is. Because she said she was going to hang out here. We'll go into Carol's in a second. You're the haircut guy. Let's see if she's in the ninth circle. Yep, there she is. Well, well, well. If it isn't the greatest American <laughs> hero, or Abraham Washington's greatest Yeah, only anyway. Abraham Washington's. I figured we'd bump into each other again. What brings you all the way out to Goolsville? Uh, stuff and things. Um, what are you doing in the underworld? She already told us why, but... My new line of work, actually. Oh, you have a new line of work. What is it? I've used the proceeds from our last acquisition to set myself up as an ammunition vendor. Pretty cool, huh? Very cool. No more risking my neck to recover bits of junk for money. Now, the cash comes right to me. That's fantastic. Care to take a look at my inventory? I absolutely care. Oh, that's cool. Okay. I will buy all of your 308s, Sydney, because 308s are what I need the most of. Don't really think I need a whole lot of everything else. That's fantastic that you... Oh, you know what? I need, I need large pistol primers. In fact, I'm going to take all primers, all powder, because those are the things that are a little more difficult to come by. That's that same, I think, mercenary sh machine gun that she was using before. All right, Sydney, that's fantastic. So, uh, hello. Okay. Another satisfied customer. Uh, she's probably going to say no, but let's ask. You know, I think I've had my fill of wasteland roaming and picking through. Gotcha. I'm just going to kick back and spend my caps. But thanks for asking. Okay. All right, Sydney. Well, I'm happy for you. Later. And I'm happy that you and I can do business ammo style. That is really good. Okay. Uh, I don't think we have a reason to go into Carol's place. We haven't talked to Gob yet. I was in Megaton briefly, but I... I forgot to talk to him. Plus, I would rather do that on camera with you guys anyways. Well, since we're here, I guess we should go down into here to see if we can find the Lincoln thingy. I don't even remember who asked us to do that. You'd think it would have been, um, what's his face, at Rivet City, Abraham Washington. But I don't remember who gave me that quest. Oh, I remember. It was the slaver guy that gave it to me. That's right. He wants us to find Lincoln um, artifacts so he can destroy them. Because he doesn't think slavery should be abolished. All right. Well, that sounds like a centaur. Oh, no. That's a ghoul. Okay, so... What I was going to show you guys is I swapped out my marine carbine for this, um, what's it called? Officer's Mercenary Rifle. It does uh, more DPS and more damage per shot and still uses 5.56s, you know, than the marine carbine did. Now, I also have a, I think it's called a marine assault rifle or something that it's an, it's an automatic rifle with a scope that shoots 308s and it kicks ass to take names but it's very expensive to shoot's the problem so until we can get a really good supply of 308s going uh we won't be using that 
But I have I have it though, um, for when the if and when the time comes. I don't think any safes are less than a average locked that I can remember. Alright, so that's it for in that room. Before we go upstairs, let's go look over here. All right, there's another set of doors. Does this go into a new cell? No, it doesn't. Okay, there is a sentient being in here. Whether or not they're friendly is a whole nother matter. Okay, we got a feral over that way. Hey, we just leveled. Well, we haven't leveled yet, but take that and that. I'm going to check those just because if I don't, there will be something there. And if I do, then there will be nothing there. That's the way it works. It's, it's really bright down here. Why do ghouls always have bottle caps on? <laughs> okay, I don't know if I can slip past this trap. I don't have a high enough survival to disarm it, but that these things go off on me without getting super close to them. Okay, we did it. There's a body over there. Take the quantum. Nothing more that way. All 
All right, I'm guessing all the other footsteps I'm hearing are up, up above us. Yeah, we came in here. Okay, let's go upstairs. That's a turret. I know those will probably shoot at the ghouls, but they'll also probably shoot at us. Did he just uh, infect us, damn it? No, he didn't. Okay. Captain Lewis's survival rifle. Really? That's a 10 millimeter rifle. It has 184 DPS. It does 16 damage per shot. It's nice and steady. I need to get, get it in the light so we can see it better. Yeah, I can't really see it too well. Oh, shit. <laughs> As usual. I forgot to put this stuff back on. All right. Yeah, we went through there, right? I think so. Let's do a little bit of a top off here. Uh, let's see, item aid. Do a bandage and an expired stem pack. That's a ceiling turret. We'll let it do all the kill all the ghouls for us. I don't think I'm gonna take all that Abraxo. Oh, a little bit of a lag spike there. Wow, it's like really stuttery in here. This 
sounded like a ghoul was running down the hall this way. Turn that off and put these on. Okay, it's a little nerve-wracking because I don't know, I don't know where that other one is. <clears throat> but it sounds like he's running for me, but I don't know where he is. Well, he's getting shot by a ceiling turret now. Do we look at that? Yeah, we did. Okay. Yeah, it's got another floor. I don't want to go up to the next floor until we've finished this floor, though. That's where we came up. Okay, I don't think we fully went in through here. millimeter pistol oh that's the locked door nice more pulse grenades can't get to that oh, here we go Abe action figure okay So now I think it'll tell us we need to return it to Leroy Walker. Yeah, he's the slaver guy. All right, we gotta watch out for turrets. Oh. 
There we go. Yeah, we gotta we gotta be picking those pre-war books up. I don't. When I see them, <clears throat> I just automatically register it as junk. So sometimes I, you know, skip over them, not meaning to. Chong Wilkes Booth Wanted poster. All right, that's probably just some more Lincoln artifacts. Let's open this just for the XP. God, that's a glowing one. I don't want to mess with a glowing one. They are bad news. But if we want to finish looting this place, we're going to have to take him out. Alright, here's what we're going to do then. Let's also, by the way, take a rad X. get this out so I think it's our maximum damage close range weapon um what why aren't you out That was weird. All right, do we do we kill the glower? I think we did. Where's his body though? Of all the freaking times for my weapon not to show up, that was so weird. I don't see his body. Give me that scrap metal. Where's his body? This is not good. I mean, we had to have killed him, right? <laughs> Please say yes. I'm keeping this shocking out just in case, man. That's just a normal.
Lincoln coin collection. do a save because I'm very concerned that I didn't find that glowing one's body. Speech bobblehead. Nice. I think that gives us plus 10 to speech. Programmer's digest. Is that a permanent magazine or a temporary? Temporary. Okay. Gives us five science. My mods uh, really dumb that down. I think you get 20 in vanilla when you read those magazines. 20 points. Oh. Lincoln's voice. Come in here. Nope, because I would have looted that. Well, I guess, I don't know, maybe our frag mine just obliterated that guy. I think we were down in that room earlier, yeah. Is there anything up here at all? There's an ammo box. Ooh, I wonder if he ran in here and fell through the floor. I don't know. Well, okay, I guess we're done here. There we go. But I noticed that. Activate display case. Lincoln's repeater. Oh, wow, look at that. It's a 44 mag with a bonus critical chance. I ended up putting my uh, cowboy repeater away because I wasn't using it very much. So it was just weighing a lot, but I'm pretty sure this does more damage than that did. It's also in perfect condition, too. Oh, nice. It's a little bit shaky, but... Can we, um, can we mod it? No, we can't. Okay. Very cool. Okay. Oh, there's his body right there. Okay. <laughs> Here I've been, like, walking around all on edge this whole time. And, uh... He got, like, well, I was going to say he got really close to us, but he actually didn't because he, he got blown up right here and then probably just flung over there. He's got a bandage on him. All right, I think we're finished here now for sure. That rifle's nice, though. I'm glad we found that. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back to the... Uh, Lincoln Memorial, and we're going to kill those slavers. And I'm going to keep all of the Lincoln memorabilia myself. Because I can. I just got to remember how to get out of here. Uh, oh, yeah, we came up this way. We'll stop back off an underworld and just sell a few things, too. 
I wonder if Sydney will buy weapons. Think you're so pretty. Oh, is it too late? It's seven thirty in the morning. Uh, yeah, and I do think I'm so pretty. Sorry, can't help it. Quinn. Hey there. Can I sell you stuff? Is it Lincoln? Uh, okay. What? Oh, let's take these off. <coughs> Terrible air down here. So she was in the ninth circle. There she is. Hi, Sid. So, what can I help with? Sure, take a look. Okay, um... I'll sell you the liquid nitrogen. She has 426 caps. Of course, some of that came from us. Can have the energy cells. I got plenty of those. Oh, good. She will buy weapons. You can have the pistol. Uh, I do. I want to keep this just because it's named. Yeah, maybe we will. This we decided we were gonna keep too. So I guess. Guess we don't really have much to sell to her then. Will she buy? She probably doesn't buy clothing, right? Yeah. yeah I'll buy. Did you, wait a minute? I thought I already bought all of her three oh eights. Didn't her inventory reset already? Must have. Okay. Thanks, Sid. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Okay. Yeah, see you. At least she doesn't say whatever, like the rest of them do. Okay. Um, alright, let's go to the Lincoln Memorial. Look at this place. Good to see you. Nice to see you too, bud. <laughs> Landmines! Shit. I was busy trying to figure out what those critters were. And I was not paying attention. And we got hurt as a result. Alright, go to aid. Take an antiseptic. Take those. Grab splints. Uh, take one of those two. Okay. I think when we came here last, we went down that side. And either I picked up the mines when we did that, or they weren't there at the time. I don't remember. I wonder if those were the Brotherhood's mines. Okay, we're still not healed all the way up, so let's do a maybe a couple of stim packs and a bandage. That should get us all the way back. 
I'm not super convinced that I like this rifle better than my marine carbine. We'll use it for a while longer, but... It doesn't quite feel like it has the same punch to it, even though technically it has more uh, DPS. Mall Northwest. Okay, this is new. Okay, we're going to have to figure out how we're going to do this. We're going to snipe the guys on the... F oh, radiation. Stay away from the water. We're going to snipe the guys on the stairs. Uh, I guess we'll take that stuff. I don't like, though, that there's not a lot of cover out here. And we don't, I don't really want to go over there by the water, you know, and use the trees because of the radiation. So, I guess what we could do is duck down into this metro station if they come after us. If we're going to do that, let's pop our head in there first and just make sure there's no enemies right at the door. Another Spec Ops manual. I forgot to read the other one, too. Let's do that now. Four more points of sneak, baby. Love it. I think we've been in here. We just never went out that door. This looks very familiar. Oh, God. He's like standing right there. Scared the hell out of me, man. This place looks very familiar. Is it though? I don't know. There's some scrap metal. Well, you can't, definitely can't get down those tunnels, and it didn't appear like there was a way to go. Well, no, it looks like maybe you can get through here. Well, no, actually, I don't think you can. It's blocked off, too. Okay. So that's really all there is in this place. Just out of curiosity, where does this one go to?
Look at all the wrenches. Oh, that goes to Georgetown. Okay. Gotcha. We don't need to go there now. Will that... I don't know if that'll go off uh, if we're not in the same cell. So, let's just put one here. And one here. Then they'll get a double whammy. So, I guess we can try and snipe from here. I'm going to put a couple more of these out. I don't like necessarily being that close to that car, though, because if they hit the car, it could explode. But let's just uh, see what we can do here. Did I hit the tree? I think I may have hit the tree. Either that or I just plain missed. All right, we're going to get on the car, but if they hit this car, we have got to skedaddle quick. I know, it's very risky. Okay, here we go. There's no way those missed. Okay, something's not right. Okay, we gotta get our AP points back. In case uh, anybody's watching and didn't see the two or three episodes back. These guys are slavers. That's why we're killing them. Well, that's the guy we're supposed to be turning the quest into. I'm going to go back and pick these up because I don't think we're going to get a big rush of those guys. Oh, and we crashed. All right, we're back, and I guess the silver lining there is we get several of our 308 rounds back that we wasted. So we'll do the same angle here. They didn't seem to be able to know where we were. I thought there were th three guys on the steps. Maybe we just can't see the third guy from this angle. Come on, don't do the blur thing. Okay, there's a guy up there. Let's grab our... Oh, okay. <laughs> I was going to say, let's go grab our frag. I didn't know there was another guy there. Let's see if we can be ready for Leroy here. Show your head, you dirty slaver bastard. There you go. 
to hold still long enough for me to... Oh man, how the fuck did that miss? Got him. <laughs> Alright, so... There's obviously some more enemies. Let's advance cautiously. Oh, right there. Okay, we're still not out of the woods yet. There might... some turrets in here. Okay, why do I still have a caution? It's a booby trap there. Okay, let's do a quick save. We'll spring that trap. Took old Abe's head off. And we have another trap here. Uh, I don't know what the trap actually is. Oh, yeah, it's a grenade bouquet. Okay. Well, it sure looks like we've cleared the place. It's still giving me a caution, but I don't know why. Let's loot this asshole. All right, he did. Poke her head out this side. Let's loot these guys. A bullpup. Assault rifle. Oh, and we're encumbered. Okay, we're going to have to ditch some stuff. Okay, let's look at armor first. That's got a VW of 5.8 and it's heavy as shit, so we're going to dump, uh, ditch that. That's a 22.7, a 9.5. Yeah, let's get rid of that too. 22.4. This shoots 5. Ooh, that's got pretty good DPS, actually. I have all of that stuff too. I've got a hunting rifle scope back at the base. Um, it's it's not real stable though, and we can't hold it still by holding our breath. See, I've got another um pretty nice five millimeter 
assault rifle back at the base too, but it's the same. It's it's really, sh you know, uh, I can't hold it very still. That's the main reason why I'm not using it right now. It's got serious um, uh, rate of fire though. It's like crazy rate of fire. But if I can't hold it still, it doesn't help us a whole lot. If we need the precision, you know. All right, well, we'll keep this for now anyway. It's worth some money, if nothing else. Okay, so that uh, that get, got us a little bit of weight back. Forty-five auto submachine gun. Let's look at that. Holy shit. 326 DPS. It's in... It's not worth a whole lot, though, but that's some serious DPS. And... We can put a drum mag and a compensator on it. I mean, it's... It's fairly stable. It does move around a little bit. Decent rate of fire. That's a pretty serious DPS, man. 372? Damn. Let's see. We're using this. That's 203 DPS. All right. We'll have to consider this weapon as a possibility. But, of course, we need to fix it first. Now, we killed another dude over here, I think, didn't we? Oh, we got a caution again. Where was that other guy we killed over here? Oh, here he is. Silas. Yeah, I remember talking to him. That police shotgun's in pretty good shape. It just threw us over the edge though. Do the head wraps do anything stat wise? One thing of perception, yeah. Doesn't have any weight, we might as well hang on to it. Well it's not worth anything though either, so yeah, screw it. Okay, uh we're overweight again, so that's twenty two point seven twenty two point four That's only 8.6. Yeah, I think we'll get rid of that. That's 16.3. Okay, do we have any... Let's get rid of that. Let's eat those. Uh, we want to keep the pre-war book, of course. All right, where are we at? 354 out of 357. We have three pounds. Three pounds to spare. Already looted that person. Okay, we've got this uh, room to go into, and I don't know if there's going to be bad bads in here or not. Let's give them a little something when they come out the door. And because we're going in close quarters, we're taking this. All right, let's do it. Nobody in here. Okay. Um, I'm not going to loot unless it's really good, because, well, unfortunately, we'll get uh, negative points, even though I'm going to take that. You know, even though these guys are our enemies. Let's take the Nuka Colas. I think I'll leave the food there. 
Don't want to overdo it. And that just put us over the top. So well, let's go here. And we'll drink. Two of those. That gets us right to 357. Okay. So we got to find a vendor. I'm going to leave the whiskey. Oh, shit. I'm picking that up. Put us over the edge again. Oh, shit. What else can we get rid of? Um, okay, that's a 22.4. That's a 16.3. Yeah, I guess let's let's just get rid of the police shotgun. And I'm, I th uh, well, we'll hang on to that if, for as long as we can. We can just go back up here to Underworld to sell anyway, so we don't have to go too far. I must have thrown that combat shotgun out. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go back to Underworld, sell stuff, and then I just don't have room for any of that. Uh, head back to uh, Megaton, and I think what we'll do in the next episode is we're going to start exploring some other areas that we haven't been into on the map and get, just get out of the city for a while because we've been in the city like i said for quite some time now oh uh, maybe we'll go north <clears throat> and hit the regulators place so we can turn the fingers in and then we've got like canterbury commons up there and union station where some more slavers are supposed to be and just kind of have some fun with all of that. And then at some point, fairly soon, we'll we'll head west too, because there's a lot of uh, stuff to the west of the map that we haven't experienced yet either. So, with that being said, thank you everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video, and we'll catch you all in the next one. Bye bye.